Hello everybody, hi, it's Ade Aluko. Welcome to another edition of Sickle Cell A School. Oh my days, today's topic. The topic is very touchy. The topic is marijuana. Yes. Um when I was growing up in Africa, I didn't really know anything about that. Uh, obviously, I see people around, grown-ups around me do it, but I've really not been interested in taking part because of my health, obviously, you know. So, um, transformation coming to United Kingdom and growing up in the society where uh, marijuana obviously is easily affordable and when you move with the crowd um that does it you are about to participate so um my first experience trying marijuana obviously obviously also listen living with sickle cell um it was a very weird experience uh i thought i was gonna pass away um but i survived it but i wanted more after my first try you know so i started smoking on a regular hanging around with people that smoke but one thing i noticed while i was smoking is that my attendance in hospital reduced like i can't remember like i was away from hospital i was away from crisis for almost nine years if I tell you people this nine years that I'm talking about that I never had a crisis I never went to the hospital it was real it was not a joke thing it was real so while smoking the marijuana I realized that he has helped me with my stress level and also with my level of pain you know um i speak to a lot of warriors on my social network that um they ask me a question like do i smoke marijuana do i find it helpful yes i do find it helpful um a lot of doctors um and practitioners might not um agree with this but yeah um when during my teenage years i did find it very helpful i find it that i i, I was not going into the hospital i was actually less stressed i wasn't thinking too much and i just i was just in a you know chill mood you know so um when i tell people sometimes well sometimes i spoke to my doctors i said i do smoke it and they try like oh you're not supposed to be doing it it's gonna um it's gonna hurt you it's gonna do this and obviously i understand where they're coming from um in for for me now um i find a uh, very helpful type of medication uh some people can take it as um inhaler some people can smoke it some people can drink it as tea so um yeah um i would say i find it helpful for me but it might not be helpful for you because one of the disadvantage of of starting smoking marijuana is that it's very difficult to stop it's easy to start but to come out is difficult so i would not advise you on that level and one of the things i saw that it can um make you visualize stuff <laughs> uh, make you um it can make you depressed sometimes it can make you smile sometimes if you're around the right people if you're alone if you're if you're a loner it can make you depressed so um that's one of the advice i'm gonna say about that don't even go into it but if regarding marijuana and sickle cell i would say it has helped me so far in a way um, um it's just it's just something that in my life I, I never thought i was gonna go through it it just happened 
so i'm just trying to let people know that there are other forms of medication that people use a lot of people a lot of warriors out there that i know smoke you know they smoke every single day you know and they go through the same thing you know they, they tell me the same thing that they find it that they more they, they spend less time in the hospital um they they have less crisis you know so um like i said it will work for some people it might not work for some people so just don't try it you know so yeah on this edition of sickle cell is cool marijuana that's my my thoughts and if you have any comments leave it below if you want to contact us you know the email sickle cell is cool at gmail.com and uh, so any social network instagram you'll find us there email sikusa is cool at gmail.com don't forget that follow us share our video subscribe to the page um and then we're gonna keep on showing what we got thank you for watching god bless